Hi, mommy. Oh, you mean, hi, YouTube friends. Hi. Taking the boys to school. <laughs> anyway, so. Oh, somebody parked really close to me. Good thing I left space in the front of me to get out, huh? Always thinking. I want to go with you. I want to go with you. What's that? Oh, I was going to buy you this book. You were? Yeah, that's awesome that you got that from the library. Why are you going to buy me? Because yes. it's a really cool book, and I remember reading it when I was a kid. Can you, can, you, can you still buy it for me? Maybe. Let's see. Did you finish reading it? No, I didn't. I, I'm like in the middle. You like it so far? Yes. Do you guys remember this book? Benikila. I remember this book. This is a cool book. I might want to read it before you return it. Can you still can you still buy me it? Maybe we'll see if you really like it. I really like it so far. Okay, we'll finish it first. Yeah. Hi, Garyan. <laughs> anyway, so I completely failed yesterday. And, um... Got you, didn't I? Failed what? I didn't fail on my food challenge. I failed on my yoga challenge. So I'm going to have to do 20 minutes today instead of... 10 minutes because yeah I completely forgot for some reason oh it's probably because I came home when I came home I had not eaten my vegetables that I took to me uh, to work with me so I ate those last night while quit Arian. I ate those while I was watching the following last night before bed because I was hungry and um, when I was at work I just decided to stay in the lounge and drink my smoothie that way I'd make sure I'd, I did drink that and get my greens in. So I drank that there and then I didn't eat my clementines. I left those at work for today just in case I, I need them. And then when I came home, I just ate it plain, um, the little container of what was left over in my vegetables. And yeah, I didn't have potatoes. I didn't have anything. So yesterday was a completely raw day. I didn't have anything cooked. So that's pretty cool. And I feel good today. I didn't, actually I, actually I did sleep fairly well considering how I normally sleep because I actually slept through the whole night and didn't wake up until 6.30 with back pain. Usually I wake up about 3 or 4 in the morning with back pain, take either alfalfa pills or ibuprofen, and then I go back to bed usually for like an hour or two. But today I woke up at 6.30 and the boys were already awake, so I just stayed up. And I feel pretty good right now. I don't feel tired. I'll probably feel, still feel tired later when I go to work. Because I usually get sleepy around 2 o'clock when I'm driving to... Or, well, I would say 1 o'clock when I'm driving to work. I usually get, like, kind of sleepy. But, I don't know. Yesterday I felt pretty good, too. And I, I wasn't tired, actually. So, we'll see how it goes. Marion, don't do that, please. Close the door. They still have six minutes before the bell rings so and it's like rainy and well it's not raining right now but it's cloudy it rained last night which is awesome because it hardly ever rains in vegas and i love the rain you guys like the rain yeah yeah did you get to go don't do that stop it did you guys get to go have recess yesterday in the rain or no no yeah. just stay inside well, it wasn't raining during recess. Oh, so you got to go outside? Mm -hmm. That's nice. It's really nice out. It's only like... It's probably only like 70 degrees or maybe 65. It's not cold. <laughs> it's really nice out, actually. I mean, I get cold easily. I'm freezing if it's under 76 degrees. So, I really can't imagine how freezing cold I'll be in the winter when... I actually get down to my goal weight and I have like no body fat left because <laughs> I will freeze my butt off because right now if I wear layers even if I wear like normally if I wear even if I'm wearing a sweatshirt even usually in the winter when it's colder than this actually though but when I wear long johns and stuff if my hands are cold or something I just can't get rid of the chill I still feel cold no matter how many you better not be messing with me <laughs> no matter how many uh layers I wear, I still feel cold, so. I like his book. Anyway, I'm glad. Is, it, is, it, is this a classic? No. Um, is I, it like I a, would say it's a classic. A lot of people like that book. Like a classic horror? Probably. It's good. I would say so. Alright, well, anyway, I guess that's it. I'm gonna go home and do my yoga. Vampire teeth. And make my smoothies. I had two bottles of water this morning, two 20 ounces. So I've had 
40 ounces of water this morning. Yeah, I need to go to Costco and buy lemons, actually. Maybe I'll do that. Yeah, it's Panicula. Oh, we already showed it. You can't see it there, I don't think. Um, anyway, so I need to go to Costco and get a bag of potatoes and I need to get a bag of lemons because I am, I think I only have one lemon left and I've been saving it for in case I make another vegetable dish or something because I really like <laughs> lemons in my veggies. What? Nothing. I just want to make sure you're not back there going like this to me like you used to do. Yeah, because I don't like that. It's not nice. Yeah, it's very... I remember that video and I was running out I'm like, <laughs> yeah, it's really not nice. But... <laughs> Hey there, so it literally took me like two batches, I would say, of cleaning to get my kitchen clean because we had so many dirty dishes, it was ridiculous. I don't know what's up with my husband lately, but he doesn't want to do the dishes and I don't want to do the dishes either because I'm the one that cooks. I don't think I should have to do the dishes, but anyway. So yeah, my sink was completely piled high and my stove was piled high with pots and pans and there's a giant crock pot <laughs> in the sink and so it, it's like, it's 10.30. I got up at 6.30 this morning and I did a batch right after I made the kids breakfast of dishes. And uh, sorry, I got my earphones here. I was listening to uh, John and Jamie from Our Conscious Life while I was doing the dishes. Hey guys. <laughs> and um, watching their uh, one of their Christmas vlogs. So, I mean, I need to like put the recyclables out still because I we put those up on the top of the counter as I'm like cooking. I usually rinse them and pull the paper off and then just stick them on the top of the counter thing right here. Anyway, let me show you. My stove, I did not clean off because it was cleaned the other day and it just has a little bit of, just a few particles of stuff on there and I'm done, I'm not doing any more, so. So here's my banana stash, and then I have some bananas in here. I was trying to get them to ripen faster, but it doesn't really seem to be working. But these are finally getting, finally starting to spot, so that's good. I'm glad, because I'm, I need my bananas. So there's my crock pot and my Vitamix, and I even cleaned the front of my Vitamix. <laughs> it really needed it. So there's my dishes, and yeah, we stick all of our recyclables up here, and then usually put them in a trash bag once a week, and then put them outside and then when my husband goes to my mom's house to drop the kids off sometimes he'll take it with him and then um if he remembers if not we'll have to take it you know on our day off or whatever but we usually wait till we have a bag or two before we take them all because too much of a pain in the butt to drive over there extra times every week because it's like I guess it's not that far but I don't like driving over there so